Welcome. Today we're going to be playing Atomic Heart. New game that's come out on Steam actually today. I'm a little late to the party still, because I'm sure by the time this uploads it might be a day or so past. But Atomic Heart is a pretty much an adventure horror style game. I think in like a utopian Russia. I'll read the description for you. In a mad sub and sublime utopian world, take part in explosive encounters. Adapt your fighting style to each opponent. Use your environment and upgrade your equipment to fulfill your mission. If you want to reach the truth, you'll have to pay in blood. Alright, so let's see what it's all about. Peaceful Atom, Local Malfunction, or Armageddon? Yeah, I'm gonna go with the, I'm guessing this is like a medium difficulty. I'm gonna go with this one, because I'm a quite casual gamer myself. Plan your skill progression ahead. The Keep doing what you're doing and it'll eventually lead to something. Alright, fair enough. I like that advice. I really love this place. Good vibes. The Chelomay complex was built from the ground up to be the ideal comfortable workplace. Can it, Glove? I've been here before. Will we make it for the speech? Oh, we've got plenty of time. We can even go on rides afterwards. <laughs> This looks so good. Chelemay City floats on the Icarus platform, a feat of modern science and technology. This city in the clouds was built in 1950. So already utopian, yeah. Leading scientists from all the other Soviet republics live here, including the German SSR. You need to have an exceptionally brilliant and dedicated mind to work here. Would you care for some more soda, comrade? All right, so we definitely are combat. Uh, sure, no thanks. You're not sure, thanks. Okay, so it's a quick time event. Gotcha. Noted. I'll be on my toes. No. Looks like another bot got stuck in a tree. <laughs> that always cracks me up. Where? Oh, there it is. Yeah, there's a bike. They're still working on the robot's navigation system. Yeah, I know. I didn't know that was going to be a character in the game, but I'll take it. Here we go, slow myself wow, to too. what a beautiful day. Jeez. What's up with your Volvo? What's your profession? They're going haywire. What like the it. hell did you do to them? They've been like that all day. Number three is bought. I need these houses painted, but look at what they're doing instead. He's got a pig on a leash? Give me your control code. I'll set him straight. Hold piggy, sweetie. Oh, thanks, Mum. Uh, the code's 0451. Okay, then. Get to work, you bums. Move it! Move it! Oh, you did it! Oh, thanks a million! Enjoy the celebration! Wow, this is crazy. Good morning, my boy. How are you? Did you sleep well? Good morning, Dr. Sechenov. I slept fine. Waiting orders. How do you like the new glove? Better than the old one. It's growing on me. I'd expect nothing less. I designed the device myself. Be careful with it now. It's more important than you might think. Yes, Dr. Sechenov. I'll keep it safe. Report to the lab to complete your integration with the glove. I've got a full schedule today, so Mikhail Stockhausen will get you up to speed. Mikhail I'll be Stockhausen. Later. Roger that. Okay. Uh, what are we, some kind of soldier or something? Or are we just like a scientist? Assistant? Something? Bum bum under the bridge, maybe? been ordered to the laboratory, Comrade Major. There is a turbine waiting for you at the airway. Are your orders clear? Crystal, get off my case already. I'm okay, pleased to hear you don't have any questions for once. You dickhead. <laughs> I will. 
I'll try not to oogle over the sights for now, but uh, maybe I'll just take a little sneak peek. Alright, I can move, cool. Comrades, Icarus platform residents, and facility guests. The address by the Director General of Facility 3826, Dr. Sechenov, is Sechenov. about Sechenov. to begin. Okay. Gather in the town square to hear his address. Alright, so that's my objective. I want to look over here first. Can I jump? Nope, can't jump. Hey, that bot's actually pretty good. Look at that nice coordination. Way. Did you just this praise a robot? Like. I'm amazed. That's because it's not constantly trying to give me unsolicited advice. Wow. Yeah, feel that. Oh, the Udi should really see it's it's right. Right. All right. Didn't have anything to say anyway. I need to change these settings real quick, though. All right, that's much better. Motion blur, you know, still kind of there. I can zoom in too. Interesting. Get yourself a spot, my social or your life will come to naught. <laughs> Sorry, I opened it there. The pace of technological progress is breathtaking. The sky's the limit. No ocean is too deep now. With Collective 2.0, I'm incredible. All right, let's get. Let's see what this is all about. Okay, they're strong. What are you looking at me like that? So, this is eventually going to go wrong at some point. We'll have to see what that is. Isn't Elon Musk doing something like this? Yeah, something like that. Oh, it sure is a utopia. This robot's starting to like, look like Saw, doesn't it? Whatever. Okay. Go to the parade deck. I bet that's going to come back to bite us, whoever that is. I think it's Dr. Sh... I forgot. <laughs> Shkinnik? Oh. Let's just take the picture the way we are. Say cheese! Get ready for your group photo comrades! Ooh, I don't like that. This is going to be bad pretty quick. Can we get the atom in the picture and the too? Statue is yeah, we get it. Okay, all right, all right, all right. No side questing yet. Straight to the straight to the point. All right. Here's the parade. Okay, we're going in there. Oh, I gotta say a lot. A lot of red, but I guess it is kind of like the calm red color, is it not? Learn about the history of facility 3826. Hear about its great discoveries and pay your respects to all the victims of war. I may. Everyone here seems so happy and content. Just like in China. You've been to China, Comrade Major? I've been everywhere. I mean, everywhere except for China, I guess. Facility 3826 isn't all that far from our Chinese allies. I like their spirit. And I hear it's nice there. Indeed it is. I'd like to inform you that that's too official. This isn't a formal letter, damn it. I don't like how that's tickling your brain. Mm -hmm. I, whatever. I probably have one in my face. I don't even know. Oh, here he, here he is. Here he is, finally. The man, the myth. Maybe... No, okay. So that's not. Why did I come to that? You fought in the war, Comrade oh. Major. Did you just remember something? No, I can't remember shit. I've been drawing a blank ever since I got injured. It's like there's something stuck in my head, but I... Lore. I can't figure out what it is. Crispy critters, man. Fuck. Watch your language, Major. We're in a public place. Thanks. Yeah, whatever. My friends. Yeah, fuck them. I kept you safe from bullets, but not the fascist plague. Now, is this a game where I like remember? Oh, yeah. Yeah, look at that. 
I gonna sit and read all of these? I'll read one. I'll read one. This one's short. Okay, that one's really short. Discovery of Polymer, 1936. A robot's best friend, I would assume. Comrades. Skena? Sketch? Sketch? I better learn that name because I'm pretty sure that's an important character. Sketch. Sechna. 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 Three times fast. And Flamenco. Flamingo create the first Soviet polymer-based hydrogen cell. From this moment on, the future of the Soviet robotics... Okay, I'm trying to read something. Dick. Robotics takes on a global importance. Realizing that it is all inevitable... Okay, you know, there's there's a billion of these. I do like lore, but I think we can, think we can skip that. What the hell is that? I still can't like how it has legs. Can be so close. Oh, that's pretty trippy. I could reach out and Comrades, with my hand. the day will come when all the planets of the solar we system will reach all the most have distant stars. Okay. Right now, okay. Right now, we ah. Major Nachai reporting for duty on Comrade Sechenov's direct order. Welcome, Comrade Major. Sketch Today on. is a joyful occasion. The birthday of Collective! Yeah, yeah, many happy returns. Cut to the chase, would you? I've got places to be. Naturally! This is the future of Soviet education. A personal project of Dr. Sechenov's poly education. Gone are the days when Soviet citizens had to spend years studying at educational institutions. From this moment on, just inject a special neuropolymer encoded with the education you want. A university-level natural sciences curriculum, for example. And you'll instantly become an educated member of society. Want to learn Korean? Or get a doctorate in nuclear physics? Or learn to play the piano? With Collective 2.0, you can! Yeah, 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 been there, done that. Skip the foreplay, bot. Excuse me, of course. Your particular case definitely calls for something more efficacious. Nevertheless, you will still need an initial neuropolymer injection. <laughs> Comrade Sechenov <laughs> is expecting you, Agent P3. I've been informed of your imminent arrival. Here, take this capsule. Oh, I thought I actually would have to clip. Oh, okay, she, she wasn't handing it to me. She was giving me a handshake, I guess. All right. Now, is that in the glove or is that me? You have oh, just upgraded your glove with scanner functionality. Using the neuropolymer as a conduit, the sensors in your glove are now directly connected to your neural system. Especially your eyes, polymer retina. To activate the All scanner, right. just make a special gesture. Please choose an object of interest and extend your arm toward it. The palm of your hand should be facing the object. Contract all the fingers on your hand, except for your thumb and index finger. Extend your thumb and index finger to form a right angle to activate the scanner. Holy shit, bot. Who designed this thing? The Spanish Inquisition? <laughs> okay. To activate scanner, hold left alt. All right. Demon, be gone. What the hell? For your information, that's a highly user-friendly gesture. It was developed by our leading expert in the field of advanced interpretive avant-garde absurdist Dadaism. Whatever that guy's been smoking, sign me up. Didn't you say you were in a hurry just a moment ago? Shut your trap and keep scanning, would ya? I'm getting acquainted with the new hardware. Thanks. You are now capable of seeing hidden objects. This ability could prove very useful in the future. But for now, please continue with your mission. Hell yeah. Alright, so we can just see shit now. Yeah. Secrets. Robot mode now. It is a robot. Oh, I don't like that. That's gonna be chasing after me. We get in trouble. Ah, 
Alright, whatever. Continuing. Continuing on. Good tool. Nice. And it's terminating. Alright. Comrades! The address by the Director General of Facility 3826, Dr. Sechenov, is about to begin. Alrighty, let's see what he has to say. Probably some real communist stuff. Oh, that's a Greetings, comrades. I am Dmitry Sechenov, and this is Facility 3826. Hello, welcome to your future. The greatest event in the history of man. We find ourselves just one small step away from an amazing evolutionary victory that will profoundly change the world as we know it. Report to the lobby of that high rise, Comrade Major. They're waiting. No, I'm not exaggerating. Ready. Just look at how our beloved Soviet Union has been transformed in the last few decades. Thanks to my invention of neuropolymers and the process of genetic adaption, it has now become possible to launch a worldwide, all-encompassing version of the So glad to see you're taking it easy, Comrade Major. The car is waiting. We must go to Dr. Sechenov's office for the access code. He's been left with one of his bodyguards. Yeah, Julie. Finally, we will be free to forget the difficult, tedious drudgery of unskilled labor and dedicate ourselves to science. On behalf of all at Facility 3826, I present to you the device of the future, the neural connector thought. It will allow human beings to be at the center of Collective 2.0, a network for all mankind together. Uniting the intellect of all individuals into a powerful mind free of all boundaries. Thanks to the Thought Neural Connector, you will control robots with your mind. Mastering academic subjects with breathtaking speed. Accessing all human knowledge and of course combining it with your Sounds own good. individual discoveries. You will no longer need control panels, cumbersome communications equipment and loudspeakers, documents, electronic notebooks, etc. Thought will replace every single one of them. And so much more. Your potential will be unlimited. Want to learn a foreign language in a minute? Master quantum physics in a day. Memorize literary masterpieces from around I'll the world. You. This all will be possible once your thought neural connector is installed right here Okay, on your we get it, we get it. All communication between your brain and your personal thought device is oh, never possible mind. via continue. a tiny injection of I love this place. No matter how many times I come here, it always amazes me. It's just so nice. Our elevator has arrived. Overcome the future. Comrade, as a citizen of the mighty Soviet Union, join your compatriots and undergo polymerization today. Stand with Collective 2.0. Learn how to control robots with your own mind and explore space. Reach the pinnacle of evolution. Now, it sounds well good. Our marvelous network will be on the 13th day of the month of June, 1955. Only two days away. Get your thought device today and become Homo Futurum among the first. The future is already yours. Alrighty, so Neuralink for walking toasters. And a very classy yet bright elevator. Uh, okay. Let's see. No secrets behind this door. Nope, can't open it. Alright. Fair enough. Let's continue. Talk about style. Science is power, I tell you. The boss has a way of looking down on insurmountable obstacles. I really respect that. There are no obstacles science cannot surmount. Other than an electronic glove that never shuts up. Here is your vehicle activation code, Comrade Major.
That's a key you got, got it. Code, but all right. The vehicle is waiting downstairs. You should hurry. You don't have much time. We can take the same elevator we took to get up here. Thanks, oh. Einstein. See. What would I ever do without you? Yeah, because that's necessary. All right, all right. Go match the elevator. Gotcha, gotcha. No interest for the wicked. No rest for the wicked. Get in the turbine. Get in the turbine. Section off here. Sorry I can't meet with you in person, my boy. The reporters have been hounding me all day. So, what do you think of Chalamet? You've built yourself a city of the future, boss. There's nothing else like it in the whole USSR. I built it for all mankind, not for myself. Humanity is on the verge of great discoveries. One day we'll reach the stars. These castles in the sky will be the beginning of our journey to the farthest reaches of the universe. I'm merely helping humanity realize its own greatness. You're a dreamer, Dr. Sechenov. <laughs> Fantasy and science go hand in hand. Most modern inventions were described long ago in science fiction. Flying machines, space travel, even robots. Are you telling me you got your ideas from sci-fi novels? I got them from the dreams of mankind, P3. Man was born to dream, to do great things. But unfortunately, there are those who wish to crush those dreams. And that's where men like you come in, Sergei. Men sworn to defend mankind and its destiny. Need me to get rid of somebody, boss? You're very relaxed about it, my boy. I hope it won't come to that. But let's take it one step at a time. First, you'll need a substantial glove upgrade. Report to the lab. A Tereshkova robot will meet you there and take you to the Vavilov complex. Understood? Yes, sir. I'm getting in the car right now. Yeah, where's the car at? Maybe I'm going to the car? Uh, whatever. Okay, so... We are a hitman, definitely. We're definitely part of the military forum. Special agent. And I think our name was... Oh, no, I already forgot. Sir, Sir, Sir... Sergey. That's what it was. Yep, alright, well, let's do it, yeah. Let's kill. Hell yeah, windows down. Some tunes. Road, road, road. Please secure your seatbelt. We wish you a very pleasant journey. Okay. Isn't there supposed to be a radio in here? Yeah, for real, turn, yeah, turn it up. You, you know the entire about. Soviet Union is ecstatic about the unveiling of Collective 2.0 with yeah, parades I just came from in every get city. It. The American government is expressing deepening concern about the skyrocketing unemployment figures following the deliveries of robotic Politics, workers from that. the Soviet We've got plenty of thought devices. There won't be a shortage, said People's Deputy yeah, Alexander Shalchinov in response to widespread concern in the city of Ozyos. How about some music? That's more like it. Oh yeah, that's my jam. For a second I thought they were gonna go the cheesy route and go Sai Ho. It's kinda groovy. Oh, wow, okay, so we're not even a city, we're just floating somewhere. Oh. I see you finally begun your assignment. And it's been less than an hour. Sehr gut. Stockhausen. What did you just say? I said the signal's on the fritz, but thanks anyway, Herr Stockhausen. Dr. Sechenov already filled me in. Don't you think that may have been a bit too much? Nope. For some reason, your response didn't surprise me at all. Guess I don't have any respect for brown nosers. Tell me, is there anyone you do have respect for? Sure, but respect is earned. Dr. Sechenov has mine because he saved my life on the operating table. Everybody else needs to earn it. Anyway, why the hell are we riding a jalopy strapped to a damn robot? Were all the jets taken or something? That's a good ass point. Riding turbines is an important tradition. It's a way to remember the days when Facility 3826 was brand new, as we used to ride these vehicles to our very first scientific complex. Fair enough, but why is it a tradition to have them pulled by bumblebees? And why do we call them bumblebees when they look more like flying pigs? Flying pigs? Have you seen flying pigs before? How about flying cows? Yeah, on the condor. 
One time some genius like you forgot to put up a fence, but those cows only flew in one direction. Straight down. I have a suggestion, Comrade Major. Why don't you worry about your mission, and I'll do the thinking for both of us. Shut the hell up, Glove. I'm trying to listen. Sassy Glove, all right. Is there anything here you haven't seen yet? I've never been here before. Zip it. What? How come? I don't know, damn it. Now quit bugging me. My Ooh. apologies. Well, they got the funk down, that's for sure. So, is there an ulterior motive for us flying up? I'm, I'm guessing this is a Utopia game, so I'm guessing the ground might not be desirable. Let's see. God, now it's funky. All right. It looks amazing, by the way, if I didn't understand it. The concept's really cool. This is Facility oh. 3826's audio guide. We will soon be arriving at our destination. Estimated time of arrival is 11.47 a.m. Outside temperature, 26 degrees Celsius. There is a slight breeze. You can now observe the Soyuz Granite Bridge spanning Lake Lazur and two of the facility's high-profile test sites, the VDNH and Sahalin. These are connected by magnetic levitation or maglev rail. This technology Cash. was pioneered by the Chelemay Design Department and a personal project of Dr. Lebedjansky. You can now observe the operations of an automated plant performing robot assembly and distributing machine parts required by the facility's various complexes. Controlled remotely by a collective 1.0 node, a plant such as this is capable of autonomously managing and fulfilling up to 100 orders per hour. So Russian Amazon, all right, all right. You drones better have first day delivery, I'm telling you. Get reprogrammed if you don't. Directly below is Dr. Sechenov's computational center, the main radio processing unit and control nexus for this network node. We are currently flying over Sunflower Solar Farms, capable of supplying electricity to the entire VDNH, as well as the Friendship of People's Park, nearby settlements, and the Maglev train lines. Maglev train stations connect all of Facility 3826, allowing personnel to travel from one complex to another with comfort and ease. We are now flying past the majestic Call of the Motherland Monument, erected in 1949 to mark the Soviet Union's victory in World War II, and are now entering the grounds of the Vavilov Complex, the site where Facility 3826's numerous agricultural miracles took root. You are now observing the Soviet Sickle Monument, designed by sculptors Elena Muhina and Alexander Kibelnikov, and autonomously erected in 1951 by the Collective 1.0 Neural Network with the help of robot builders. Note that this effectively makes it the world's first collaborative artistic effort between man and machine. <laughs> Alright. Our brief guided tour is coming to an end. Facility 3826 is always ready to welcome new specialists from anywhere in the Soviet Union. We are confident that you will be thrilled to live and work in this world of revolutionary breakthroughs and fantastic scientific achievements for the glory of the Communist Party and the Soviet people. Control wow, for initiating combat maneuvers. Uh, initiating what? what? For real? Watch out! What am I supposed to do about it? Please do not unfasten your seatbelt until the vehicle has come to a complete stop. You have reached your destination. You are now at the laboratory gate of the Navajo Alpha Bus Grand Facilities. Have a nice day. Thanks.
Take my hand, comrade major. I will escort you to the Vavilov complex. Ah, uh, thank you. Okay. What in the sweaty hell is going on here? Unfortunately, I have no information on this uh, subject. That doesn't look All up. the robots look have been carrying out their normal operations until they suddenly became hostile. Yeah. Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. What are you slip. doing, lousy bot? Get your rusty metal asses out of here! That was really very rude of them. The elevator is now operational. Okay, even the fire drone. Okay, cool. Awesome. Fuck okay, off, no, bitch. get out. Whoa, whoa. Our ascent is once again continuing normally. A Drofa towing robot will be here shortly to perform uh, magnetic coupling okay, and fine. take us by air to. to Son of a bitch, not again! Uh, um, oh, help me, Comrade Major! I'm falling! Uh, I would, Shit. but. Hell of a good intro, all right. Now I'm guessing we're gonna figure out why. Why? Oh, that's, my glove works, good enough. Is it alive? I mean, I guess I was talking, so it must be. Oh, you came out pretty unscathed. Okay, wow, she went bad quick, huh? At least just me and my glove. We'll be fine. As long as we have each other. And a glowing stick. Oh, an axe even better. Gucci axe? Goddamn. Wizard, this is P3. Come in. Sergey, are you alright, my boy? I'm okay, boss. But nothing here is the way it's supposed to be. Uh, Whatever's going again. on clearly started a while ago. Victor Petrov is the reason. He's a traitor <laughs> who hacked into Collective Central Hub and caused the oh, civilian uh, robots oops, to uh, attack okay, the Soviet employees. Petrov has the access codes for the hub. Bastard the mission Petrov. is to find him and bring him to me alive. Copy that, sir. The target is oh, Victor Petrov. Okay. My mission is to find him and bring him to you. Exactly. Session alive or dead? Dead. Gotta do it. <clears throat> Ooh. Had to least see if they drop something. Okay, all right. Big swing. Okay, I can charge a big swing. Can I block? Oh, I can sprint. Dodge? Dodge. Okay. Alright, so we have to find the complex entrance. We're going to kill Petrov. He's the die. I've swum through Polymer plenty Ooh. of times and I haven't drowned yet. It's a freaking miracle of modern science. What the? What the hell? Oh, do, uh, do I have air? I have oxygen? Oh, good, right? There's an entrance just around. Yeah, is he looking at me? Oh, oh, they're looking at me. Get out, give me. Get out, give me out, give me out, give me out. Alright, well, screw it. Watch out! Oh, yeah! Whoa! Hell yeah. Get out of here. Metal parts, synthetic neuropolymers. <clears throat> Ooh, I'm about to loot the hell out of this game. Oh 
Oh yeah? How about this? Yeah, modern technology doesn't win against the axe. Now that, that would be a little harder. Loot crates? No, okay. Oh, okay, you want some too? Come get some. Wow. Oh yeah, one strike, easy. This game is gonna be easy. Yeah, this apocalypse won't be that bad. Now there's some secrets in here. Oh, okay, there is a way to get out of Alright. Weird. Very weird. Holy shit! Hey, what is that? Yes, Major. Any details on the target? Victor Petrov is the lead engineer behind Collective 2.0. He was arrested for treason and sentenced to community service at the Vavilov complex. Got it. I can deal with that. Where should I start looking? Petrov is currently somewhere in the underground levels of the Vavilov complex. We'll have to find a way inside. Okay, let's do it. Help! Somebody help me! Hey, you! I'm coming! You alive in there? No way. Don't tell me he's down there. Oh! Yep. Shit! Uh, get away from me! Oh, Lily shoved me toward. Nah, nah, come on. Ow! Oh, go fuck yourself! Left one, right one, come on. Get the My mustache, oh, man. <laughs> Whoa, okay. <laughs> What are you gawking at? Yavushka, thank Almost you. choked to death there. Give me a hand. Oh, I didn't see that coming. Mm. Oh. You should be more careful. Granny Zena. This place is a damn madhouse. Yeah, I noticed. Uh -huh. Thanks for the help, no ma'am. No sweat, Sonny. What are you doing here, anyway? Oh, just passing through. Who are you? Me? Zena. Granny Zena. That's all you need to know. Okay. See you Fine, I get it. So what's going on here? Lots of casualties. I don't know if you noticed, but the robots are attacking people. Anyone who couldn't find a place to hide is dead meat. I could really use a weapon. You got anything? I just picked up an axe, did I not? Of course. But I'm not giving you shit. Beneath us is a complex. If you need a weapon, go down there. The Vavilov complex? That's where I'm headed. Ah. Well, today's your lucky day. I'm heading that way too. It's a basically safe. Uh, what's that? Shit! It's a chilla. Son of a bitch! We've got thirty chilla? seconds. Move your ass! Thirty, 30 okay. seconds right. until what? Uh, thirty seconds until we're fucked, sonny boy. Royally fucked. Oh, drone oh, strike. Good. Okay, all right. Yeah, Get go. over let's here, go. beefcake! Now, 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 now! Take this key and turn it clockwise. I said clockwise, idiot. Yeah, like that. I'll hold him off for now. You got a hell of an arsenal there, lady. What are you okay, planning? Just away. Here yeah. we go. Huh? Cool. You've been riding my ass for two days now. Take that. Eat shit and die. Okay, please. Yeah, okay. All right. Uh, shit. Uh, uh, that was for me, right? That that. Where'd you get that thing? No Give it to way. Him. You hang on to that key. I got this. Uh. Oh, let's come our way. Holy shit! Ooh. I knew that thing. Oh, I knew it was such. Here's out. Here's out. Still going, okay. All right. Oh, I'm the one who made it down here, huh? <laughs> Quick cigarette break. Okay. 
fair. It's the time to do it. What a goddamn clusterfuck. Yeah. I agree, Sergey. I agree. What the fuck have I got myself into? Locate the door handle. Can I open this? Can I? Oh! Sure can. Oh, I don't like that. Why is, why is it undulating? I like to think that's an item. Ah, whatever. We need to find a way to open this armored door. Gee, you think? Enough with the lame advice, Die. will ya? Why don't you tell me more about Petrov? Yeah, How'd they track him down anyway? Petrov's betrayal was discovered by Mikhail Stockhausen. He was then arrested by the Argentum unit. So how'd he end up here? After the trial, Just Petrov kidding. was sentenced to community service so and sent back zombies. here as a prisoner. What, they couldn't find anyone else in the whole Soviet Union to do his job? Collective's launch was only a few months away. Replacing the lead engineer would have been foolish. Petrov had to finish what he'd started, and that's what they made him do. What's so special about the guy? Victor Petrov was previously the lead engineer of a secret department within the Academy of Consequences, dedicated to programming robots for Collective 2.0. Right. This momentous task is made possible okay. by the use of advanced breeding methods this coupled with a highly developed system. Don't you move. I, I literally just said... I both look like Ronald Weasley's. Alright. Yellow paint means it's climbable. Climbable. Now we in the trenches for real. Okay, just check. Just check. Excuse me. What is this? X? Oh, that was probably health. Okay, well, whatever. Let's find this door handle in this mine shaft. That's where I probably find it. Sure, it's like that. Thank you, grab your hand. They can hear you. Chirper found the old sky. This is an emergency log entry. I'm a programmer named Ekaterina Vishnevskaya. There's been an incident at the Babylon complex. The robots have started killing everyone in sight. Right now, I'm in. Hey, who's there? They found me. Stay away. I've got a grenade. Hey, lady. This is Sergeant Major Ibrahimov. I'm human. You need to come with us. It's dangerous here. Get away from me, you monster. No, listen to me. She's crazy where they're actually really good. Hey, they're robots, so she probably isn't wrong. Yeah, we'll go away from that hole. Yep, yeah, no. Pass on that. We'll just jump over this way. On the other side of the door! Is somebody there? Yes. Maybe. Just turn the handle! Oh, that's open okay, that's not right. Just thought it was, thought it was like pipes or something. Alright, whatever. That wasn't a robot's place. No, it's Alright. Oh, shit. Hang on! Hang on! Yeah. Do I really want to go in there, though? The lunch break for staff members with low social credit is now beginning. Regular personnel okay. are continuing at their inventory. You tell me I've had a gun this whole time. Oh, yes, yes, that's a chuggy shotgun. But most likely, you probably can't use it right now. We have to get ammo. Um. Yeah. I'm glad that they had it. Okay. Safe areas. Break rooms are the game's safe areas. Each is equipped with a manual save game machine. All right, cool. It's like a Resident Evil type of. I'm safe. All right, well, loot. Mm -hmm. Yes. Ooh, four shotgun shells. Mm-hmm. We did great use. I bet there's crafting in this game. Fading data. All right, all safe. Let's go. Okay, back to the screen. Okay. And the machines rose. 
Well, that was anticlimactic. Okay. Ford is forearmed. Forewarned is forearmed. Enemies can perform powerful attacks and knock down P3 down. If, knock P3. That knock P3 down if they hit. When an enemy is charging a power attack, indicate to dodge it with left shift. Yeah, I think I already got that. Thank you anyway. Oh, you want some? Oh, okay. May I give you some advice? I'm kind of busy right now. Try to avoid the robot's more powerful attacks. Ooh, they're all powerful. Attacks performed by a robot okay. during a power surge are especially dangerous know. and may knock you down. Shh, why didn't you tell me that before? Yeah, good God. Okay, that was actually... Yeah, they learned a thing or two. All right. It wouldn't jump. hurt to collect... Collecting resources in Masse. If there are a lot of crates in front of you, hold F in that direction to move oh, in that direction and move from one to the other without releasing F. This will allow you to collect all the resources. All right, so quick other collect resources you find along the way, Major. Yeah, thanks. I just read that. May I remind you that your oh, gear includes sick. a special Yarov Abalakov backpack for storing items and equipment. It utilizes a quantum singularity to shrink items placed within it, then restores them to their original size upon extraction. Yeah, weird science, huh? It's like we're living in sci-fi times or something. A little self-awareness, never hurt anybody. That is an awesome way to have a looting system, and that's probably the best way I've ever seen a game describe fitting a bunch of shit in your backpack. All right. <laughs> Thank you, thank you. Another watch. Look, is there actually these like circuits in there? I was about to say like just a timepiece has seven frames. But it's also Why the future. Why did you turn that thing on, huh? We were ordered to turn it on when you got here, Comrade Muravyova. My orders are to document everything and you can document your own ass if you want to, but you're not recording me and let me through. And don't call me Comrade Muravyova. I'm Granny Zena to you, Sonny. Uh, we aren't allowed to let you through, comrade. Uh, Granny Zena? Not without authorization. Really? I was always allowed in here before. Granny Zena, and now I'm not. Secrets? Listen here. Either you let me through right this instant, or I'll come back later. And somebody else will be cooling his heels in here. What you say? <clears throat> Go ahead. That's what I thought. Dismissed. Dismissed. Okay, so she's definitely there for the plot. Don't know what I'm looking at, but I'll press F. Ah, uh, here we go. Order. Let's see. Order from the Comrade Sechnov, director of the facility 3826. All employees of this facility, 3826, including service employees, are to undergo polymerization. Polymerization. On June 10th, 1955. Make sure everyone signs the protocol after the procedure. Okay. Note. From HR Smirnov. That's a name I can pronounce. To security manager Nyakov. Hmm. I might have to say all those in Texas twang so they come out right. In response to your inquiry, here is my evo evaluation of prisoner V. Petrov. Mental state, nervous, impulsive, working at Plastica Theater. Plasti Plastica? Okay. Plastica Theater has had an obvious effect on the prisoner's psychological state. He has been obsessed with theatrical images for several months now and recites poems by some unknown poet in his sleep. Physical state, average health, occasional nervous tick. Security status, flight risk. Despite Comrade Sneknov's personal request not to use harsh methods to prevent his escape, constant surveillance is recommended. P.S. unofficially, Petrov has been losing his marbles for a while now because of everything that's happened to him. Psychologically speaking, there are no objective causes that could have led to his psychopathy or his obsession with the theater. As a result, I believe that the theater is more than just a workplace to him. I suggest sending a team to search on his workstation. Okay, yeah, obviously, I mean, I think my boy just screwed us all, but we'll, we'll see. <laughs> to all security employees, I'd like to call your attention to the fact that Zin... Zena, well, Granny Zena, aka Granny Zena, yeah, exactly, is not allowed to enter or approach the sapling warehouse without authorization under any circumstance. Comrade Mariovia, Mariovia, 
has previously taken seeds and saplings of experimental flowers back to her dwelling under the pretext of performing an inspection, then cultivated them privately. Since these plants are in early experimental stages, they have many characteristics that may not be yet fully studied. This could be dangerous. From Vavaliv, Vavaloiv Complex, Assistant Manager V. Zolotukin, Security Nyakov, Top Secret. Inform Karad Shnekov about the incident in the germination workshop cordon off the what cordon off the hospital where the victims are being treated let no one in to the ward or other medical personnel and comrade Sechnov. incredible all right little sci-fi computers <coughs> back to killing some robots oh okay there's a door didn't need to jump through the door. Oh, whatever Sneak up on the robot and perform a stealth attack. I'll use the opportunity to permanently disable it. Okay. Die. Oh. Okay. Time to hop. Let's rip out his heart. You take that. Yep. Yes, sir. More lore. Have a seat, Mihail. I just need to finish my work, and then I'll help you with that report. Lab Tech 84, bring Comrade Koltsov some tea. I'll be with you in a second. Okay? Oh, the loot is all mine. Yes. More! More! Oh, does it want to give me, like, a translation? Okay. Computer. Programmist. Okay. Please. Who cares about all the dead guys? Whatever. Still would understand how they just decided to die in their seats. They didn't, didn't run, didn't fight, just nah, I'm just gonna stand by. Hey, is that a pair? Like that. Is it working? All pairs at facility 3826 pairs. are connected to emergency power and are never turned off. This allows employees to remain in constant contact. But I need, like, a password Smart. or an access level or something to get into a pair, right? I can provide you with access to any facility device. This also applies to the chirpers you will surely encounter while en route to your mission objective. Got it. Fair enough. From Security Assistant Manager Y. Mukterev. Mukterev. To Lab Supervisor Lifnav. Last night, Lab Assistants. Skippy and Leppy taped a photograph of our comrade Shnekov, Sechnov, sorry, to a vova and allowed it to wander around the halls in this state. Janitor Nefdova passed out when this vova looked at, looked at her through a window. Give them a, a, an official reprimand. All right, being funny with robots, nothing wrong with that. Is there something that I can click? Oh. Yeah, let's put a face to all these names. And that's all I got time for. That was Mark Zuckerberg at the bottom, but whatever. All employees from facility 3A26, including service employees. You are undergo polymer. No, we already got that. The same thing. Yeah, okay, alright. Lore completed. Still have my axe. Let's go. Uh, okay, those ones are unlootable. Mm. Alright, I'll, I'll peep this. I'm, I'm just gonna. Okay, hardworking, extrovert, very loud. Uh, okay. Blah, 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 blah. All these employees are going to receive additional hazard pay for three working days. Try to up the paperwork, make sure it goes well. Be kinder. Be kinder, my friends. Okay, right, stay frosty. This lore is immaculate. Hey, glove. My name is Charles, comrade major. Hey, Charles. Whatever. Hey, how'd this Petrov guy manage to hack Collective? The traitor wasn't working alone. He was conspiring with several others. Several, huh? So where are they? They have already been eliminated. But it will be impossible to get to Petrov without your assistance. That's why you're here. Yeah, you know you need me, Charles. Liz Charles. 
Charles. Combat going on? Alright, alright. Yeah, no, no, no. No, go ahead. No, go ahead. You want to get some? Get some. Yeah, that's what I thought. Nothing. Good posture. Alright, so you have to be really sneaky. You actually can't just walk around. Oh, but I shall. I shall walk around. I shall do just that. Wasn't there something just. Yes, sir. Sure, let's hear Laura while I do things. Why not? As a Soviet scientist, I've always considered myself an atheist. But right now, there's only one thing okay, I can say. Here. May God have mercy on our souls. We've locked the magnetic door to the cable car tunnel. But I don't know how long we can keep the robots inside the complex. Hey, this didn't all just Ivan, happen this second. Is it me? This, this has been going on. Or did that been bush up. just move? Oh. Ivan! Ivan! Sneak attack! I love how sneaky that is. Just punch him in the back of the head. Ah. Game runs incredibly Damn it, why is everything locked here? Emergency mode was activated as soon as the robots began attacking humans. Facility 3826 is on lockdown. That includes the inner sector. So how am I supposed to open this door? It's locked with an electromagnetic lock. So I need to fry it with an electromagnetic pulse. How the hell am I gonna do that? Your glove can be equipped with an EMP generating shock module. A capsule containing the neuropolymer required to install the shock module should be somewhere on facility grounds. Convenient. Okay, I'll deal with it. So is Charles not my left hand, the glove, or is he just like a, he must just be an AI in my head or something. All right, nice, conscience. Something's Sass. wrong. Oh shit! Ooh. Okay, sandworm, sandworm. Oh, I thought about that. Okay, cool. Okay, never mind, back gosh, spoke too soon. I was going to say, Jesus, this guy falls through a lot of floors. Very many times. What was that, strike three? That he's fallen? Come on, get up, soldier. <sighs> Great, just a little more. You okay? I'm fine. How many fingers? Uh, four. Four. Great, now get up. I need your help. <sighs> Alright, I guess we'll be fine. It's kind of fresh, no big deal. Who are they? They brought Soon you here. Dead. Put pressure on this wound. They tried to save you. And who are you? Doctor. You got a name? No time for small talk. <laughs> Doctor, no damn. Forceps. Forceps, forceps, forceps. Come on. Get me them. What's this doing here? What took you so long? You got a neuropolymer capsule. We don't need one. Yeah. So what's your name, Doc? Larissa, and you ask a lot of questions. You know what? You're on your own. You got this. Where are you sure. going? It's useless. We don't have the equipment. I've got the equipment. Great. Now we're getting How somewhere. did you do that? You ask a lot of questions. Uh, I'm a bad uh, Get out! The Larissa! Terminator's head! Oh, no, oh, no. Five minutes of Freddy's? Okay, alright. Holy shit! Avoid the beam! Avoid the um, uh, can I kill you? Can I kill you? Die? Over here, you little fucker! Get some, come on. Oh, you ain't nothing, you ain't nothing. I am missing every shot. <clears throat> Samurai kick me, okay? Yeah. Uh, ooh. Pro game. Terminated. Charles, That's where does the shaft Larissa crawled into go? It's hard to say. The ventilation system contains a large number of branching ducts. Fine, I can deal with it later. Alright, first boss fight. 
Fairly What's easy. What's that freaky thing on the door? A lock. Are you serious? Then uh, open it already. Lock? Come on, we're in a hurry. I'm unable to assist you. I lack any kind of lock picking functionality. You'll have to find your own method for picking locks. I'm sure you're smart enough. Yeah, right. In other words, you're basically useless, as always. Try snapping your fingers at the exact moment the locking pin light goes on. Oh, no. Oh, my God. I got just in time. I mean, with no problem. I had plenty of It, it worked. <laughs> okay, man. Shotgun. Amazing. You got a creepy. A lullaby? I don't like this. Charles, <laughs> what's on the other side of the door? That's Nora's voice. She's very dangerous. Oh, check that. Uh... Where is she? Health pack? Oh god, I didn't realize my health. Okay, I'll take one of those. Yeah, the, the egg juice. What the fuck? Whoa. Fuck me! Oh, what a stun! I can't get enough uh, no jumps. Let me tie you to the bed, baby. What in the hell is this? No need to fight oh, I think we found Nora. Oh, no, stop. Don't let her bind your arms. Bind your arms. Can't you see Bruh. I'm trying? Open to suggestions. Bring me to her sensor manipulator. Quick. How titillating. Rebellious dominant men really turn me on. Oh, I'll turn you on, all right. Just let me at you. What a brute. Oh, I love tough guys. I'm on fire. Tell me Closer. Closer. I can't reach her. I'm trying. I'm trying. She's one strong-ass bitch. I'm at your service, sugar. Anything from my master? What can I do for you? Well, you could. More skills will become available to you soon. But choose shock for now. Yeah, all right. Oh, is this like upgrading or something? F. Oh, how can I resist? Now let me show you what I can do. Professionally, I mean. I've seen it. <laughs> Literally. Crispy critters. I am here to help you upgrade your red-hot pocket rockets. And believe me, handsome, you can upgrade whatever tickles your fancy. Weapons are useful. Open the corresponding window, Major. Get rid of that. I can do so much more. A quick romp with your axe is just a taste of things to come, you handsome beast. Did you enjoy it, big guy? Yeah. Cool. I swear Use this this powerful it. weapon to <laughs> split the skulls of your enemies and bring me gifts so we can get down and dirty. I'll show you what real smut feels like. <laughs> Why should I bring you gifts? Girls like being pampered. Because the repair vendor needs resources to break them down and produce items. Luckily for us, it's not very picky. Although, some upgrades may call for unique components. <sighs> I take it the facility is full of all kinds of junk. It is indeed, Comrade Major. I'll keep an eye out, then. I can't wait for your strong hands to grope my interface with lustful abandon. That's it. We're done here. Let's go. You're done. You're done. Okay, well, that's an interesting way to... Yep, alright, we're going. Thank you, no thank you. There we go, back to hell. And by hell I mean more lore. What's with those bovers with black bodies, Nikolai? Regular VOV A6s follow my orders and are always polite. But the black ones walk around like they own the place. They go wherever they want and just ignore orders. Yesterday one of them bumped into me and didn't even apologize. They only Great, the goddamn elevators are out. What am okay, I supposed to do? That. Jump down? They have no power. If you reconnect the power, they'll start working again. So it looks like I need to find a circuit breaker. But where the hell is it? 
I can follow the wires, but they're all hidden inside the walls. Electrical emissions can be detected via scanner. True, true. Where am I even trying to go, though? That's a good question. Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> okay, I can just hold hold my hand out and chop at the same time. Convenient. Um, I guess it's this way. I mean, if I can't go that way, or maybe the, the giant double doors. I think that's where. Nope, that's where I came. Okay. Oh no, I went the right way. All right, we're good. We're chill. Duh. Supply room's locked. Well, that's just fucking great. I can't just snap my fingers here. I oh. need a key. And let me guess. You can't open this lock, can you, Charles? Charles, you're useless, not. Goddamn it! But I can set a waypoint you can use to find the key. It should be in a nearby workspace. You're finally Never mind. starting to come in handy. Yep, useful. <laughs> low blow, low blow, Sergey. Whoa! Almost fell. Okay, let's not do that. Hello there. Combat in this game is so But awesome. take care. Oh. There's a dandelion security camera up ahead. If it detects us, this place will be swarming with robots. Take it easy. I can always distract it by throwing something, then knock it out with an EMP. Okay. No idea how to use the EMP. I don't think I've ever shown that yet. But you guys might have seen that. I have not. But we'll find out. We'll figure it out. Just slow. Secret bathroom loot. In there. Oh, okay. Pick one item. Hold F to. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Come wait, Major. You oh. said you knew how to avoid oh, the camera. Shit. I expected more subtlety from a professional such as yourself. Okay, Sometimes you just on. need to go in guns blazing. Yeah, this yeah what he said. was one of those times. Whoa! Uh. Yeah, I just want to test out my new axe. You know, professional one. Yeah, you are not This new axe is sick. Okay, come on, come on. Whoa! Okay, all right, you got some, you got some. I'll let you get a free one. Check that out. Okay. How many are we talking? All of them? Oh, two's nothing, come on. But I still, uh, obviously have no idea how to do the box. Okay, pick it up. Press L. Nope, pick it up. Hold F. Yeah, okay, that's how we do it. Lesson learned. Well, you know what? Oh, I did it again, huh? You know, man. <laughs> God damn it. Okay, still no idea how to use the EMP. It's not one of my abilities, is it? Right. Looting on that area, I can do that quite well. Not the button I wanted. Okay. Ah, it's on the table. Aha! I want to be. You found the key. We can access the circuit breaker now. Yep. But I'm just gonna have a look around first. I need some parts to upgrade my weapon. I won't get far with this pile of shit. Yeah, I yeah. wouldn't dream of stopping you. Smart move, Charles. Smart move. So you're telling me a handful of traders somehow managed to hack into Collective, a network created by the best minds in the Soviet Union? Technically speaking, Collective has not been hacked. No one could possibly circumvent the algorithms created by Professor Lebedev's team at the Academy of Consequences. Then why is all this crazy shit going down? The traders introduced a false combat mode into one of Collective's algorithms that causes the central hub to see all humans as invading soldiers. And our scientists That's really good. can't fix it without Petrov. They can, but it will take some time, during which many more people will die and information about the incident will make its way outside the facility. Don't 
scan me. Please, thank you. Oh, V, okay, so that was, okay. That's not a door I can, okay. Um, loot, loot, loot. Give me loot. Very convenient. All right, I can, I can take on anything now. Secret loot? Oh, that's my first loot. See, I missed loot, that's why I'll get double check. so fast, Major. Hey, let's put a cookie in there. Yeah, even locks like cookies, right? Oh, God, I key, uh, Charles? Yes? yes? Do you like cookies? Uh -huh. Charles, you're not giving me a lot to work with you. This is a passive security system with a laser relay. I've seen stuff like this plenty of times. You need a color code. Unfortunately, we don't have any codes. You'll have to try to decipher it using logic. Seriously? Like I was gonna stand here until it turns off on its own. This level of smart ass assery is unmatched. Oh, am I gonna have to read this? I, I bet I I bet I have to. Okay, the decoder. Comrade Vision Vi Comrade Vinny. Regarding your question about the functionality of the beam decoder, the bulky system is passive security device. Yes, as you correctly remarked, any child could operate it. But while this child of yours is entering combinations, a signal is sent to the security panel, and the guard on duty can stop any unauthorized actions. Whereas in an emergency, it can be operated by any untrained employee, by an untrained employee. Also, due to the software limitations, robots cannot control the beam decoder, which reduces the chance of an error in the event of robot malfunction. Does this answer your question? I suppose. And congratulations on your shit. Okay, no, so I didn't need that. No, just... <clears throat> Unlock the passive security relay functions by putting the magnetic fluxes in the right order. Yeah, I'll just wing it. Send some beams. Okay, so blue needs to be down. Uh oh. Uh, oh, okay, we need the blue. Okay, so these don't even matter. The blue just needs to be sent to the bottom. Not that one. Yeah, the power's on. Yes, sir. Let's head back. I'm sure nothing's gonna attack me on my way. Back. Well, which one? I suggest the one on the right. In other words, you don't actually know. In that case, I'm taking the one on the left. Good call. Good call. Bolt to the end. Oh, gosh, I have to take it. I've marked another waypoint for ease of navigation. How dense do you think I am? I know where I need to go to complete my mission. I was only trying to make things easier for you. You can make things easier by getting off my grill. My grill, home slice. Come on. Hop off. Boy, hop off my grill. If you recall, the door is electromagnetically locked. Yes, Are you freaking deaf or something? Pardon me. Please continue. There we go. Okay, combat shock. You shock on enemies to stop them in their tracks or even kill them. All right, cool. More lore. Could care less unless it shoots. I do not care. Combat, I do not care. A lot of, a lot of, a lot of parts to make cool shit. Okay. Set, moving. You didn't see it, see bitch. Oh, okay. I 
Let's see if you can see me. Oh. Just don't alert everybody else. I'm fine. I get some of this. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Whoa. Whoa. Actually, how about this? That's right. Worth every bullet. Don't. No. 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 Oh my. Okay. Yeah. Come on. Run out. The suplex has got to stop somewhere. Oh, a little close. A little close. I'm stuck on it. Ooh. Actually, a lot of HP. I should probably be a little vigilant there. Is this health? No. Okay. Safe room. Safety. Okay, safe. Fading data. More loot. Not bad. More cartoon. Dead silence. Okay, it's fine. Authorization. Major Nichayev, codename P3, access granted. What do we have here? Do I have any upgrade points? I sure do. Electrifies enemies, yeah, why not? Give me some of that, thank you. You'll be able to use this ability in, and all sub abilities at the cost of all the. You won't be able to use this ability and all sub abilities. The cost of all abilities will be returned, are you sure? No, I guess. Because I don't know what that implicit. Oh, you're, you can sell it back. I already have that. Okay. I think. Yes. No, okay. I. No, no. I, no Please select the desired procedure. That's nice. Okay. That seems like I need a lot more things. So I think next time, I'm definitely going to want a good shotgun, that's for sure. I think saved my life already. Can I upgrade anything further? Oh. 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 Cartridge. On my axe, I can get a cartridge module. The installation of the cartridge module allows the application of a thin layer of special chemical polymer in the weapon's blade. And it Additional properties when it comes into contact. Yeah. Yes. Physically have no idea what that did. Okay, well.